one, two, one, two, three, four. Talk of dreams, it means so much. We're so darn close, we can almost touch. We don't know where we can say when. But sooner or later, the light will shine in. about love. It's a song about bitterness, despair, and failure. In other words, it's a song about love. <laughs> Come on, Adam. You're just <laughs> upset about what happened between you and Karen. What do you mean? Nothing happened. That's the whole trouble. She turned me down like a two-week-old meatloaf. You and just... for that klutz Stephen, too. But you gotta understand, you just didn't have what she was looking for. It doesn't matter. Maybe somebody else will come along and will be perfect. This is so embarrassing. I mean, it punches my ego right in the gut. Robs me of my masculinity. It makes me feel like a kid again. I'm glad to see you can handle it, Adam. <laughs> oh, yeah, Chris? Well, I'll bet you've never been turned down by a woman. You know what? You're right. <laughs> oh, they can be so cruel. Now, hold on a minute. This problem does not just pertain to the male sex. Oh, yeah? Yeah, as a matter of fact, there is a guy at school right now who I am just going crazy over, and he completely ignores me. Maybe, um, maybe he doesn't know how to get your attention. Look, can we just stop this talk? The way I feel about love is the way it's expressed in the song. Now, either we're going to play it or we're not going to play it. <laughs> Let's just take a break in here, okay? It's getting a little tense for me. Okay. Good idea. Plus, I'm sure you're about ready for a popcorn break anyway, huh, Mark? No, not me. Uh-oh, call a doctor. You mean you're not hungry? <laughs> no, I, yeah, I just don't have an, an appetite. When you stop eating, it means only one thing. You're in love. Well, oh, there is this girl. Uh, Woo! Uh, not so. And, and I've been getting to know her a lot better at school. And I'm liking her a lot more and everything. <laughs> is it anybody I know? Yes. But see, I don't want to tell you just now, because, see, i got to see if it's going to work out or not. Oh. Yeah, well, save yourself the pain and forget about her, Mark, because it never works out. Oh, come on, Adam. Just because your this. romance with Karen and what's-her-face didn't work out, doesn't mean Mark's won't. Thank you, Darcy. You know, that makes me feel good. Well, as a matter of fact, a girl would be pretty lucky to get a guy like Mark. No! Oh, excuse me! What are you doing? <laughs> Can't jog on an empty stone. Now, Mark, why are you jogging? Suddenly, I feel very happy. Listen, I got to get down to the store and pick up a few things for my mom. You want to come with me? Yeah, I guess I'll go. Have fun. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Hey, you know, there are a lot of great-looking chicks down at the mall. Yeah, but none of them will be Karen. Well, that's not true, Adam. Karen could be down there shopping right now with, uh, Clutsy Steve. Yeah. Don't worry, Adam. You'll get over, over Karen, and you'll find a great girl like mine. Adam, seriously, now, this, this guy at school is driving me bananas, and he doesn't even know I exist. Don't let it affect your music. Okay. There are plenty of guys, Darcy. But, Mark, this guy is a 
babe. Hey, there are plenty of guys that are babes, but you just gotta know where to look for them, and they're full of surprises. What's this, rehearsal over already? Yeah, we weren't agreeing on a love song. Adam had this bad trip with a girl at school, and he wants us to play this yummy song. That's yummy. Mm. That's, that, that happens to be my personal business thing. Well, you. I happen to think that love songs should be tender and soft and sweet. What do you think, Gary? Well, I don't know. Everybody's got their own definition of love, you know. Even old Gary. So, give me that microphone there. And put it down right there, because I'm going to lay my definition on you, all right? All right. Clouds are taking shape tonight. I see a bear, you see a kite. It is up to you. It is up to me. Rain upon a window pane. Stay inside, go out again. It is up to you. my song tonight by your lake with moonlight love is in our clouds tonight love is in our clouds love is in our clouds tonight you and i go up and down but spirits seem to turn around it is up to you Yes, it's up to me Love can take a lot of turns But what you give is what returns Oh, it is up to you It is up to me For you it's a moon with a lake and a view For me it's a song that I sing about you So we can sing my song tonight by your lake with moonlight love is in our clouds tonight love is in our clouds we can sing my song tonight by your lake with moonlight love is in our clouds tonight love is in our clouds love is in our clouds there to express feeling. So, if Adam feels badly about love, then Adam should be able to express it. You see, guys, he understands. You know, Darcy, I have a song that you might like. Um, I've been working on it for weeks. It's the, the pretty tender type uh, love song that you like. You know? and I, I've been writing it for that girl. Well, I'd love to hear it. How about tomorrow? I really want to get going home. Oh, okay. Darcy, Darcy, I almost forgot why I came in here. This showed up for you. It was by the rehearsal room door. Well, who's it from? Well, I don't know. Read the number. From your secret admirer. Gary, who's been in the store today? Well, let's see. In the last hour, um... Oh, that, that kid from Champs, uh, Calvin. And Mr. Abernathy. He finally noticed me! Oh! oh Mr. Abernathy? Calvin! probably got things to do at home. Bull, sit down. Sit down. What's going on? 
How come you never got married? Well, a lot of reasons. Uh, I wasn't ready. Didn't meet the right person. One of 10,000 other reasons. Yeah, Gary, but you've been in love. Sure, sure. Uh, my first love was in kindergarten. A girl named Susan. Well, all the other six-year-olds were busy hating girls. I was writing their love notes. Of course, they looked pretty dumb written in crayon. Not if you meant what you wrote. That's very true. I'm in love. At least I think that's what it is. I can't eat. I can't sleep. I can't even think straight. Yeah, well, that's, that's either love or the 48-hour flu. Yeah, yeah, but she doesn't even know about it. And I'm afraid to tell her, see, because I'm afraid she may not feel the same way. And, and right now, we're really, really good friends, and I at least want to keep that. Oh, sure, sure. But I don't want her as a friend. God! I, I've been writing a song. And I haven't had anything but her in mind for weeks. Well, why don't you play it for her? If she don't get the message then, ma'am, she never will. I think I will, as soon as I finish it. Hmm? Oh, Gary. Thank you. You stay in here and you finish it up. And don't forget to lock up, okay? Yeah, I think I better work on it. All right. Good night. Good night. All right, so, uh, you can take care of the place, okay? Sure, Jam, no problem. Okay. And lock up. Sure, a million times. Over and over. Okay, 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 this is okay. Uh, okay, uh, any questions? Yeah, just one. Where are you and your girlfriend going, Jam? Oh, uh, just to the movie at the drive-in. Uh, you want the suitcase? Oh, I take this in case I run out of gas and I gotta stay at a hotel for the night. Ah, the old fake running out of the gas trick, huh? Who's faking it? You know, I can't afford these gas prices nowadays. I'm taking them out to an expensive dinner first. I'll tell you something. Dating when I was a kid was a lot cheaper than it is now. How so? Well, for one thing, I never ran out of gas. Prices were cheaper then. Not only that, I didn't have a car. Dating was easier then. People sure are different today, champ. Let me tell you how different, Calvin. Take my baby out and do it all right. Pizza joints and movie shows and dancing all night. But these inflationary times are put an end to my buck. So going out lately is a stroke of luck. Drive a car from pocket calls and nominal legs. Dinner and a movie cause you know she'll beg. Looking at the bill, your eyes are bulging large. Cause you just hit the limit of your master charge. <laughs> so bring back those good, good Saturday nights. Bring back, bring back those cheap, cheap Saturday nights. Yesterday's dollar, you could take it to Rome. To go there today, you gotta mortgage your home. So bring back, bring back those good, good Saturday nights. You can put that down, Jim. If you think I'm joking, let me set you straight Cause I've been hitting bottom every time I did But if my reputation goes, hey, I'm washed up and damn It's burning my wallet to remain the champ So bring back, bring back Those good, good Saturday nights I said bring back, bring back Those cheap, cheap Saturday nights Yesterday's dollar, you could take her to Rome To get to the day, you gotta mortgage your home So bring back, I said bring back Those good times Saturday nights Well, I better get going before she changes her mind But if she did, think of the money you'd save <laughs> Yeah <laughs> See you, Take it easy, Calvin. Look after everything. Oh, I will. Don't worry about it, Jeff. Hey, Calvin, what's cooking? Hi, Pete. How you doing? Want a soda or something? Sure. Did the coach come down on you for being late? Oh, are you kidding? Hey, the team needs me more than they need him. 
He would dare. Besides, without me, he's probably out of a job. You could be nicer to the guy. Uh, waste my time. Listen, Pete, I already have ten colleges that want me to play for them. I can't worry about Coach Arnold. They might ask him about your attitude. It'd sign me if I were a convicted criminal. Pete, they all need me. Just be careful. Hi, Calvin. Oh, hi, Darcy. Oh, hi, Peter. I, I didn't see you there. Here I am. Yep, you sure are, as usual. Can I get you something, Darcy? No, thanks. So, Darcy, uh, how's the band? Fine. I, um, I heard you were in the store earlier today. How do you know? Gary told me. Yeah, I wanted to get the new Springsteen album. Have you heard it yet? Huh? God, he's really great. Yeah. Well, I'd better start to close up. Calvin. Yeah? Thanks. I can't wait to open it. Open what? This package you left for me. I've been trying to get your attention for weeks now. Hey, this is the 80s. I don't leave packages. So, uh, you've been trying to get my attention for weeks now, huh? Yeah, I thought this package was... Well, I'll tell I'm... you what. My girlfriend's coming by to pick me up in about half an hour. But if you'd like to come in back and spend a little time with the man you love, Peter will watch the place. You creep! You disgusting creep! She's right, you know. You are a creep. Why'd you do that to her? Hey, it usually works. Come on, Pete. Let's close up. You don't need any help, big shot. All right, let's do it. I'm ready. Are you sure? I'm sure, Adam. Now let's do the song. Darcy, is there something maybe you want to talk about now? No. Let's, Let's just stop it. wasting time and do it. Okay. Oh, just count it off. Me. One, two, one, two, three, four. It's easy to read. This letter comes from you. I'll just throw it away Cause your words never come true I'm feeling the pain of your lies Falling into your heart Is it wise? Cause I know I've heard it before I've heard it all before About how You're gonna treat me right I've heard it all before It takes more Than the words that you write Heard enough, I heard enough from you. I'm feeling the pain of your lies. Falling into your heart, is it wise? Cause I know I've heard it before. Heard it all before About how you're gonna treat me right I've heard it all before It takes more than the words that you write I've heard enough, I've heard enough from you I've heard it all before About how you're gonna treat me right I've heard it all before It takes more then the words that you write Heard enough, I've heard enough from you Heard enough, I've heard enough from you I like it. Let's do it again. Hold on. I mean, wait a minute. Dar Darcy, what happened last night? Hey, no big deal. This isn't like you. Yeah, well, I saw the light about love. Maybe that light had something to do with the package that Calvin left for you in the store? Yes, and thanks for reminding me. What? Hey, why'd you do that? Because I felt like it. You don't even know who that's from. It doesn't matter. Hey, look, Darcy. You want us to take care of Calvin for you? Huh? <laughs> don't bother. He didn't do anything unusual for a guy. Hey, don't put all men in the same category. Well, you guys are my friends, and I appreciate that, okay? 
Hey, look, uh, why don't we just take a break and go to Champs and get something to eat? Great. Are you sure Calvin and his magic hands aren't working? Oh, he and the rest of those jocks are uh, practicing football. His magic hands are making other passes. <laughs> I guess you're right. Come on. Hey, can, can I play that, um, that song that I wrote for you? Thank you. If you're talking about the mushy one, you can forget it. You can give it a chance. Okay, do you have the lyrics right now? Yeah. The words are hard to say because I don't want to scare you away. I want you to stay. I want you as a friend, but it would be hard to pretend and not say. I don't want to hear these put the music. They're garbage like love. You know, those mean something to me. Yeah, well, maybe they won't when you've been hurt. How do you know I haven't been already? The words are hard to say Cause I don't want to scare you play that song for me, huh? Yeah, you know, I'd really like somebody to hear it before I chuck it. You listen? Better believe it. Thanks. The words are hard to say Cause I don't want to scare you away I want you to stay not finished yet. song with those words and feel that way because I wasn't feeling that way about love and it just it wouldn't come from the heart I like I love you you're my friend you know I can talk straight to you I can trust you I, I gotta get going I'm sorry Darcy see you tomorrow huh 